Our production number 4825, program 10, take one. Can we be quiet now, please, studio? No, it shouldn't be Ole, that's from Spain, but this uh, melody is from uh, Russia, I think, a Russian folk melody. Uh, and that's the melody we are going to play in this program to start with, and um, why don't we get started at once? Uh, but we are not going to play it uh, the same way I did. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, uh, <coughs> with three chords on the left hand, E major, with the first finger on the third string, and then A minor, you know that one as well, it's two fingers. And then just by moving the first finger to the first fret, first string, you got D minor six. And it sounds like this, with the right hand, one, two, three, one, two, three. So it's three, four times this time. <laughs> All right then, uh, why don't we just look at the picture behind me here, so you can do it all the same as I did now. The first finger, first fret, third string, and then P for bass on the sixth string, one, Ima, Ima, P, Ima, Ima, very good. Move to the next chord by moving the first finger to the se uh, second string. First fret and the second finger over there. And now the fifth string as a bass. One, two, three, P, Ima, Ima, P, Ima, Ima. Very good. I think you're marvelous. Thank you. uh, it's just one third left now. <laughs> now uh, let this finger remain on the string and move the first finger to the first string. And then an open second string makes the sixth. And then the fourth string as bass. One, two, three, P, Ima, Ima. I think that's a lovely chord. Aye. So, back again to A minor. P, Ima, Ima, P, Ima, Ima. And then back to E major. P, Ima, Ima, P. Da, di, re, da, da. And here we have to move to the next chord. P, E, Ma, E, Ma, P, E, Ma, E, Ma. And back to the E major chord again. P, E, Ma, E, Ma, P, E, Ma, E, Ma. And where do you think we're going now? I think we're going to A minor. P, E, Ma, E, Ma, P, E, Ma, E, Ma. And here comes that one. P, E, Ma, E, Ma, P, E, Ma, P. Ima, Ima, P, 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 Ima, Ima,
my, what do you think about my text, <coughs> lyric? It's beautiful. <laughs> it's lovely. Well, it wasn't, it's something about I and some uh, kiss. Uh, oh, you know that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> the tragedy <laughs> about missing kisses or what it is. Well, anyway, now, take from the beginning now. La da pi e ma e ma 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 pi da da di minor la da da pi e ma e ma a minor da 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 di la di da 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 that's it, yes, very good, thank you very much. Uh, now, do you remember last week we had a rhythm, a melody called Beyond uh, the Twilight, mm. yes. and it was a rhythm, lam taram tam taram tam taram. So we've all be already talked about that, and you can see it also here within a bar, <coughs> a dotted quarter note, an eighth note. <laughs> A quarter note. Uh, and then something is added to it. Over here, you find within one bar, three, four times, three quarter notes. One, two, three. Can you tap them? One, two, three. But this is rest, and you should not tap them. So how about not tapping them when I'm pointing <laughs> them? One, two, three. You're very good at not tapping. <laughs> but then here, you have to find out if there is uh, something that should be tapped. If you take the, the uh, line under here. One, two, three. Exactly, that was a quarter note at the end. Over here. One, two, three. Exactly. And now look here. Uh, could you tap this now? One, two, one, two, and three. 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 Tam, 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 tam. That's the way it works. So it's just to, to think of a beat, but not having it. And then, could you try to play the melody as well? It starts on the first fret, the fourth string. And do remember what I said now about having mm -hmm. one finger for the first fret, the second finger for the second fret, and so on. So, la, da. But here, it's something wrong. And if it's wrong in, the, in your book, change it. It should be three. And even over here, like that. No, nobody can see who stands there. <laughs> <laughs> Take one smaller. One, two, three, two, two. Good. One, two, three, two, two. One, and so on. No, oh, two. Uh, do remember now exactly that when I'm play, uh, playing <coughs> with the first finger, the second finger, and the third finger, when I'm there, I'm uh, letting these fingers rem remain on the string. So I can very easily get back. And so on. And also the thumb on the back of the guitar neck, and uh, under it, not uh, high up, as some sometimes used to happen. But well, anyway. <coughs> now, there is something you haven't seen before. Uh, C major chord, looking like that. Uh, but this one you've seen, but it's without it's, uh, the, the six now, and that is depending on the way you play with the right hand. This time only with P, I, A, not playing at all on the sec uh, second string. And I will <coughs> just show you before doing it what it looks like. With the um, left hand, two fingers over there, stretching the ring finger so it's placed very close to this fifth string and third fret. Pressing it down, lifting up the others. You see, I'm always very close to where the finger should be pressing down the strings. And that's the, uh, a sort of a rule. Don't move away from the strings or the frets if not necessary. 
And then the right hand is blocking like this. E, I, A, I, E, I, A, I, E, I, A, I. And then moving to the C major chord, the same pattern with the right hand. E, I, A, I, E, I, A, I. And don't move the hand very much, just the fingers. Because then it's easier to find your way back. All right? So we'll take a look now at the what it looks like. Two fingers for D minor. Um, and now, right hand, P, oh, just, just before we do that, we do some exercising with, with that uh, stretching your third finger. Mm -hmm. Could you do that? Place it just above the third fret, fifth string, uh, and then press it down, take it up again, press it down, and down, and up, and down, and up, just in your uh, own speed. And then let that finger remain. And do the same thing with the second finger. Lift it up, press it down. That helps you to give the correct order to your fingers if you do that a couple of times. And then the first finger, the same thing. And when done that, do with the both fingers at the same time. Very good. And now we start with this uh, bass open <coughs> four string. Now, P. I, A, I, P, I, A, I, P, I, A, good. And now, the C major chord with the third finger and open strings. P, I, A, I, P, I, A, I, very good. And back again to D minor. P, I, A, I, P, I, A, I. A, I, and then C major, P, I, A, I, P, I, A, I, and back again to P, I, A, I, P, I, A, I, C major, P, I, A, I, and D minor again, P, I, A, I, that's very good, you are fantastic. <laughs> now we can make a big orchestra all together. Um, now, this is what you will find in the book. Every bar contains this right hand pattern, P-I-A-I. -I. So it should be, in fact, the same over here, but that you can pretend is written. Just remember it. Uh, now, we start with D minor. P-I-A-I, P. -I -A -I, P I A I C major P I A I P I A D minor P I A I P I A I C major P I A I D minor P I A and here comes the rest. It's just we are halfway through now. <laughs> no. P I A I P I A I and C major P I A I P I A I and then D minor again P I A I P I A I C major P I A I D minor P I A and that's it yes and now somebody. <coughs> Uh, sometimes um, uh, thinks uh, is a chord always looking that way with one finger or should it be so and so and so but there are many ways to play a chord and this is one way to play the C major and D minor chord we will find other <coughs> types of chord as well later on but we wait until then uh, anyway it should sound about like this when you do it in the speed right speed and now Again, watch my both hands. They are not moving away from the strings very far. What shall we do with the drunken say? Come on, what shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Early in the morning, hooray and up she rises. Hooray and up she rises. Hooray. She rises so in the morning. 
so well you will also very soon be able to read uh, the, the note values. If you first think of 4 sixteenth, is it the way you pronounce it? 16th yes, yes. notes. I, could you tap them? 1, 2, 3, 4, that's it. And now if I write an 8th note, note and 2 sixteenth notes, that means 1 and don't tap the Three, four. All right. What da di dum da di dum, and that's the rhythm for what shall we do? And then taking just the last one here, making that a dot over here, putting them together. It makes one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's it, this. And that's exactly what you will find in on that one. Um, could you tap this? Bum. Good. You are reading perfectly, I must say. <laughs> Absolutely incredible. Could you try to play that as well? <coughs> Starts on the on the uh, second fret, third string. Two, 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 zero, three, two. <laughs> Was it difficult? All right, that. But that's the way it should be done anyway. So uh, we continue with the open string now. Dun, 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 dun. And here you can have a trick. Place both fingers before you play it. Uh, third and second finger. And then with the thumb. Long, bum, bum. That's it, yes. Now, two, 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 zero, one, three, one, two, zero, two, zero, zero. You've done it. You've done it again. <laughs> how melodies have you? How many melodies have you been playing now? <coughs> oh, seven. About seven or eight. Yeah, very many. I think you're great. Could we do this as well, just to start of it? Uh, can we tap this first? Lam, tam, ta, tam, tam, pam. Once more. Lam, tam, ta, tam, tam, tam. Exactly. Hooray. And up she rises. And now try to play that fast as well. Do remember that you can play with your right hand and change the fingers, alter the plucking fingers. Mm. Dum, da, dum, dum, bum. <laughs> and that's where it goes into trouble, yeah. <laughs> yes, of course. But we, we uh, got one week to get ready with this. <laughs> All right. So when we meet the next week, you will be able to play that. I just wanted to show you how to do it. All right? I will play it for you just so you can hear <coughs> it right through. And do watch again that I still have one finger for the first fret and so on. <laughs> famous one. But here comes something else. Uh, there is a book called uh, Play Together, and we have been playing together from Play Together before. Uh, and uh, I want you at home <coughs> to play together with us as well. And you are playing the first part, uh, if you do as I point here. Uh, so we just help to get going with the first line first. Uh, when it says uh, fret two, um, first string, and three quarter notes above, it means you repeat the, uh, the, this figure three times. So, one, two, three, one, two, th third fret, third fret still, fifth fret. Good. Four, 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 
five, five, five. You are very good now. So let's see what happens when you play uh, the, your own part. <coughs> because there are now four different parts, and we are divided into four groups now. <coughs> so let's go. Have a try. All right? One, two, three. No, no. And uh, now we take it from the beginning again, because now we know you can play it. Uh, would you then do as I heard somebody already started to do, singing the part you are playing? See if we can make a choir out of it. And uh, we must say we haven't rehearsed this one. So it's quite honest. I don't know what it's going to sound like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Try it. One, two. In the Second uh, page uh, once more. Yes. All right then. Alive, 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 crying cockles and muscles, alive, alive. Well, it's not only pretty girls, it's pretty voices as well. <laughs> Thank you. No, it sounded very good. I'm, I'm so surprised. Uh, that you could make it so fast. Uh, would you do it once more? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd love to listen to it. One, two. In the... Oh, in, take the start. So we, could we take the first chord on the... No. Yeah, a little bit more voice. No. That's it. That, that's where you got it. Thank you very much. Keep, stick to that, all right? One, two. In the... Once more. All right? Are you ready now? Yes. One, two. <laughs> In Dublin, fair city, where girls are so pretty, I first set my eyes on sweet Molly Malou. As she pushed her wheelbarrow through streets broad and narrow, crying cockles and muscles. Anyway, see you next week. It's been nice to see you this week. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Yeah.